Hey everybody, Scott Sprinter here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Saturday, March 9th, 2018. Got a free pick coming up in just a moment. College Baskets, where we swept last night. We'll get to that. But first, a quick note, if you've yet to become a member over at DocSports.com, just want to give it a try. Real cool way to give it a trial run. Click on the link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account. Think you'll be glad that you did. And you can use those free $60 on any of my daily packages or anybody else over at DocSports.com. Again, it all starts $60 free account by clicking on the link below the video. Uh, as we mentioned, we swept our college basketball card last night. That included our premium plays over at DocSports.com. It also included a VMI here with another free winner. We got a free pick coming up in college basketball for Saturday in just a moment. We mentioned a couple of days ago uh, that we've had 16 winning years, only five losing years, 16 and five last 21 years with March Madness, Big Dance, uh, conference tournaments, the smaller tournaments uh, lower than the Big Dance level, all over the last 21 years, 16 winning years, and uh, picked up a couple of nice wins on Friday's slate. You can get the rest of my college basketball picks right through the championship game in April, all the smaller conferences in between. Get it all at DocSports.com for only $299. Real nice discount off the regular price. Uh, you can grab that right now as we speak. A lot going on on Saturday. I've got a total of 11 plays going on Saturday, and that includes a little bit of everything. First of all and foremost, uh, I've got my first eight-star college basketball play of the season going on at DocSports.com. It's a Saturday afternoon game. It'll be available Saturday morning, DocSports.com. Part of a five-play package in college basketball. We aim for a 5-0 and card. We've got that eight-star play, first one of the season. And I love the big cards, as you all know. In the 2019 calendar year, uh, we are 11 and 4, 73% with our basketball plays rated five stars or higher. Again, just love to be able to have a lot of games to pick from. You can usually find a couple of uh, games with a lot of value. And again, on this 11 and 4 run, 73% against the spread in 2019. And our first eight star play of the college basketball season goes on Saturday afternoon. Again, there's five college basketball plays. In all, led by that eight-star play. You don't want to miss out on that. Coming off the red-hot sweep yesterday in college basketball. And as I mentioned, 11 plays in all. So what are the other six? Well, I've got NBA. I've got the NHL. Nice underdog. My dog in the NHL for Saturday. NBA, as I mentioned, up over $2,700 for $100 per unit betters going back to January 2nd. That still leaves four more plays to go. We've got American or Alliance of American Football, the AAF. We've got one play for Saturday. We're 2-0 with our AAF plays so far this season. And I've got three fights that I've got my money on on Saturday. One from boxing, two from UFC action. And uh, by the way, since we've come on board at Docs, which was April of last year, we are 14-4 and in the fight game. We are up $4,600 for those wagering just $100 per unit. So be sure to go grab those. The AAF, the three fight picks, all 11 plays overall. And of course, college basketball, 5-0 Saturday planned, led by that eight-star play. It's our biggest Saturday, uh, all sports combined, uh, going back, I think, since I've been at DocSports.com in, in almost a year there, 10, 11 months since I've been there. So uh, go check it out Saturday morning over at DocSports.com. All the plays will be there for you. And uh, we looked to have a big, big day on Saturday at DocSports.com. And, of course, we'll report back on that uh, on Sunday morning's video around 4 a.m. Eastern time. Uh, so that's what's going on. And, again, don't forget you can get the rest of the college basketball picks right through the college basketball championship in April, 299 bucks. My baseball package, they're up right now over at DocSports.com. We closed last season on a 66% run over the final three months, including the playoffs. In Major League Baseball, we picked up over $7,000 for $100 per unit betters. And uh, again, the baseball package over there also. Don't miss out on that because we are just 11 days from opening pitch, regular season baseball. Uh, a couple of games being played in Japan uh, that weekend. And then, of course, the following week, everybody gets involved. All right, let's get to the free pick for Saturday. We'll have to continue the run here with free pick winners. We're going to back team 610. That is Marquette minus the points over Georgetown game time has been moved to 2.30 p.m. Eastern Time, 11.30 a.m. Pacific Time. Listen, Marquette can still finish tied atop the conference with a win over Georgetown. Uh, they'll need a little bit of help from Seton Hall, who's taking on Villanova. Uh, Marquette, by the time this game tips off, should know whether or not 
Uh, they got that help from Seton Hall because the Pirates take on Villanova at 12 noon Eastern time, two and a half hours before this one tips off. Uh, but after dropping three straight games and blowing two out of those three with late leads going by the wayside, I think Marquette and Coach Wojo is going to have this team focused throughout this contest, whether Seton Hall helps them out a little bit earlier in the day or not. Listen, if you saw what they did against Seton Hall, it was nauseating. It was sickening. I had Marquette in that game. Uh, they were laying a couple of points. They're up 64 to 55 in the late stages of the second half. They go. They, they missed their last nine shots of the game. They got outscored 18 to nothing by Seton Hall uh, to wrap up the game, and we lost that. And Marquette did too. And I mentioned this is two out of three where they have blown leads. They probably should have won. And that goes back a couple of games ago when they took on Villanova. They led that game in the late stages of the contest and fell by the wayside and failed to cover in a 67-61 loss. So that started this three-game skid, but I need to get back on track. Marcus Howard is a man among boys when it comes to his offensive skills, 25 points per game. He only had six points. He only goes two for 11, including two for 10 from the three-point line in that loss last time out. But at home, in his last three home games, he scored 99 points combined, 33 of 65 shooting, including 43% from the three-point line. Listen, I know Georgetown has been Jekyll and Hyde. They look like trash one day. They look extremely competitive the very next, like they could be a big dance, deep run turning team. I mean, they're all over the place, but they're running into Marquette, I think, at the, at the wrong time. Uh, I do see I've got about 15 books on my computer screen in front of me, and I see one, nine and a half. Everywhere else, though, it's 10, so we'll grade it at 10. Marquette minus 10 over Georgetown, the free pick in Saturday's college basketball. Again, uh, that time changed to 2.30 p.m. Eastern as far as the tip-off is concerned. Don't miss out. 11 plays on Saturday, DocSports.com, including five big plays in college basketball, led by our first eight-star play of the college basketball season. Again, we look to improve this outstanding run with weekend top play basketball. Now 11 and 4, 73% weekends in 2019 with our basketball plays rated five stars or higher. Go grab that first eight star play and let's win again. All right, listen, if you like these videos, be sure to click on the thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. We appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Sprouts of DocSports.com. Let's put Saturday in the win column. I'll be right back here Sunday, 4 a.m. Eastern, 1 a.m. Pacific with our next update.